A Mumbai court has ordered a fresh trial in the 2002 hit and run case against actor Salman Khan who faces charges now of culpable homicide not amounting to murder. All evidence and witnesses will now be re-examined in the case that is already more than a decade old. It's over 11 years since September 2002, but time has almost come to a standstill in Bollywood actor Salman Khan's hit and run case. Five months ago, a court upped the charges against him from rash and negligent driving to the more serious culpable homicide not amounting to murder. On Thursday, the court granted the actor's plea for a fresh trial. It's been more than a decade since the hit and run incident involving actor Salman Khan. The case has dragged on with many twists and turns, and now it seems that process is likely to continue with the court ordering a fresh trial. In September 2002 the actor's car rammed into a bakery in Bandra killing one person and injuring four others. Booked for rash driving within a month Salman was arrested and spent 18 days in jail. The police then booked and rearrested him for culpable homicide but in December 2003 the Supreme Court ordered the trial court to decide on the charges against the actor. Finally 3 years later the trial began with Salman being charged for causing death due to negligent and rash driving. In July this year the sessions court slapped the charge of culpable homicide not amounting to murder after the police said there was enough evidence. But with the prime eyewitness constable Ravindra Patel who alleged that Khan was at the wheel now dead, activists allege it would be used by the defense to push for dropping his testimony. Delayed by another 5 years, it would give Salman enough time to do his movies. Salman non-availability of Ravindra Patel is a matter which nobody can change. In Mumbai, Saurabh Gupta for NDTV.